NBC 15 News starts now. Hello, and thank you for joining NBC 15 News on the Web. I'm Christine Belport. Here are the stories we're following for you today. City leaders in Jefferson are looking for another company to move into the Tyson Foods facility that will be closing next year. 400 jobs would be eliminated. The company said its facility was getting too old. The plant in Jefferson and the plant in Chicago will close by next October. At the state capitol now, Republicans push to become the first state in the nation to prohibit transgender public school students from using a bathroom or locker room assigned to the gender with which they identified. Well, opponents, including students who stood and sat on the floor in that packed hearing room, argued this proposal is a violation of their civil rights. If you're heading to Camp Randall tomorrow for the Badgers game, you're urged to give yourself extra time. The UW says there will be an increased police and security presence. There will also be a snow removal plan in place. The primary focus would be clearing the field, walkways, ramps, and entrances. Also, just be warned, some sections of the stadium may not be entirely cleared of snow by the time the gates open. By the way, tomorrow's game against Northwestern kicks off at 2.30. Those are the stories we're following for you today. Go out and make it a great day.